Uh... Hi. This game is now Super Mario RPG 2, like the actual one, not Paper Mario. Because there, there's no Luigi, so it can't be Mario and Luigi. Since you can't have Mario and Mario, it's just Mario. That was the worst thing I've said for an intro in a while. Anyway! Oh, that's multiple money. Okay. Well, that gave me absolutely nothing. Anyway! Uh, this is Let's Play Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga. I don't think I said that yet. Last time, we finally got out of the cheap area, and then Luigi crashed into Yehi Valley, so we have to actually find him and stuff. And by find him, we mean, like, go to a different place and... Well, what was that earthquake? Hopple? No. no. This. This is that green guy. Which means that red guy should be around here somewhere. Well, for now. Rookie, tie this guy up. So that must be string. We know Bowser's Balletta, so why does Popple have a rookie again? That's not how that works. I know there are blocks around here. Don't remember what. No, I guess there aren't blocks around here. Thanks, game. Thanks. Anyway, these are stronger versions of the Dry Bones from way back in Woohoo Mountain. Uh, you have to fight them with Mario, obviously. They're weak, obviously. Ow, well, that wasn't weak. Really, you should just avoid them, because you don't have a need. I mean, they give you Ultra Mushrooms, I guess. This is yellow pipe that should lead... Yeah, you can't climb back up with just Mario. So you have to go down anyway, and this is where we need to go. If... The torch... Is any indication. I'm... Please, game, don't make a liar out of me. I guarantee in about 10 seconds we're gonna find the room that Pop... We just saw Pop in. That's a very pointless pathway right there, unless there's a hidden something... Nope, not even a hidden block. It's just there, because... They decided to put it there, although... Nope, can't even climb on top of the face. Very bizarre. So yes, this is where Luigi was. And that's where Luigi is. So, wait, oh, you actually have to do fire around the right way. I can't have to... See, this, does this does that count as quick time events and cutscenes? Because no one likes quick time events and cutscenes. Does that count as one of them? It's still stupid. Anyway, yeah, ha ha! What an emotional reunion! Oh wow, my hanky is sopping wet with tears! Boo, stupid who! You rat, I've been waiting for you to arrive, see? Oh yeah! Want to found me a rookie here, one that'll take you down for me, see? Darling, what's all the I don't. Yeah, it's Birdo again! Don't remember the voice I used! I don't even want to say half these lines! So. I'm gonna. Let's. Let's. Can I... Can we do the boss fight instead? Um, this is... Dude, you could pause the video if you actually wanted to... Okay! Just... You hit... That is the A button being pressed very many times! Alright, Mario... Okay. Didn't need that anyway. Thanks. Um... Uh, yeah. So, interestingly, it actually calls... Oh, that didn't do anything. It actually calls Birdo Birdo instead of Rookie, which I think is weird, because, I mean, even though we know that the first Rookie was... What's... Is, is it Bowser, Bowser that, that that one. Um... I, like, like... You know... Well, I guess when Bowser was Rookie, he knew, he thought he was Rookie. That's an interesting, interesting attack. Luigi. No. Oh, that was a ham. Great. Great. I needed that. Good thing I'm a tank. And he's using the super hammer when we have the ultra hammer. I'm actually going to use swing bros. Um, 
the, 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 are you gonna go do the So yeah, this is obviously oh, there's an ultra seer. Okay, that was nothing. Anyway, this is be can't do the other attacks because no hammer, so I'm gonna just jump. This is like the other fights where Bowser was rookie. You're going to want to um What? The, 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 aim the wrong way. And then okay. So this was like the fights where Bowser was rookie for probably the fourth time, I think. You want to defeat not Popple first to get the extra EXP money and I think item drops and this is still doing absolutely nothing in terms of damage, but I'm doing it anyway because we're going to get healed afterwards, so why not do that for the... I didn't get the hammer back, so... You know, I was going to actually take advantage of the whole lowered defense thing to... Okay, so it's the opposite first, and then the, the one that you aimed at. Oh, great. Well, that Popple managed to somehow devalue the Ultra Mushroom, or maybe he's still a regular Mushroom, I don't know. Is it- I know he had regular Mushrooms left, does, so if you don't have any, does he steal an Ultra Mush- a Super Mushroom or Ultra Mushroom and heal by that amount? Because I know- I don't remember- Ultra Mushrooms might heal, but like- okay, I got my stuff back. Uh, I should be using Knockback, the Cyclone is fairly useless. But, I mean, I don't really, I don't see 9, 9, 9, did even less than fire, but I need poison? Uh, I think this is, this must be the variation on the bros attacks, I guess. Yeah, okay, yeah. So you can put Pied Popple in eggs, but you're not going to be targeting Birdo in the first place, so it's not, well, I guess the eggs can attack you, but. I... Can I really... Am I really this bad? I can't tell who the egg is attacking. Alright, so presumably if you hit the one with Popple in it... Oh, I actually burned her with the... Oh. And I can't target Bird... Okay. That's problematic. So I'm gonna... Let's break some eggs. What the heck was that? What the... Okay, I'm not, not gonna judge game. This one has... That was... What? What? Is this... Thing? Alright, Mario, you should not be still dazed. Okay, let's... Probably should have healed Mario. Good thing that was the right egg. He's, oh, well. He's dead anyway. No, that only... Um... Wow, you guys are really not taking advantage of Mario being, you know, completely incapacitated for like two turns there. That just is like Popple's like, yeah, should we like actually make it hard for them to see or understand? Yeah, I don't know. He's not been shown to be the smartest one, obviously, but that was just. Alright, what are you gonna do? Luigi. Oh, I get it. The reticle flashes on the one she attacks first, first, and then on the other one. That, it makes, it all makes sense now. Okay. I'm gonna see if I can get, just get the burn back on. Probably should have checked to see how much HP Birdo has, because I know... Rookie Bowser had a huge amount of HP the second time. And, well, Popple, well, I don't know. It's only a matter of time. I mean, lower defense and uh, burn... If I just spam Luigi's Bros attacks, I can- I'm gonna actually steal from- You can only steal once per enemy. It's not like other RPGs with stealing function where you could steal like as many times and the odds just get lower each time. And by that, I'm- well, no. I was gonna say by that I mean Final Fantasy, but other games do do that, I'm sure. And I'm not- I'm not gonna be super cheap and saber. What the- how did that not do any- okay. What I was trying to do is you can only steal from each enemy once. There's a big trick in a later boss fight that will actually let you get infinite golden mushrooms, which I will show off, but not really, because... Great! Doing that thing again. Great. 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 I'm, I'm only complaining because the animation for this is really long and you can't hit Birdo until you get rid of all of them, but... Eh. What I was going to say is we already stole the Ultra Syrup from... 
pop with no from Birdo. So I'm gonna just try to. All right, that one jumps twice. Yep. Okay, I guess the one that jumps twice has to be the one with Popple in it. So we're gonna jump on the one with Popple in it, or at least the one I hope. Because that. Oh, the ones. What? I don't get those little pig things. Are those pigs? I think they're pigs. At least Birdo doesn't like heal in between turns. She's actually taking damage, if you think about it. Cause okay, he's in every single one now. He's like actually he's always in the last one. Is that is that the way it is? He's always in the last one. Okay, we'll take a bunch of damage. All right, Mario's dead. What? You did one damage! He did one damage! How did that even work? But, it, it, Mario, you really might want to be able to start moving again. He got two turns in. All right. Don't have a hammer, so couldn't have done that anyway. I'm gonna actually use Swing Bros, try to steal from Popple. Just see if he actually has anything. I guess I missed the action command, thanks. I, or he didn't, or maybe he need to get the advance in order to steal, I don't know. The, that was, that was Birdo. Um, <laughs> great. Um, did he just run away? Did he just really run away? Or am I supposed to defeat Popple first? I was supposed to defeat Popple first, wasn't I? Yeah, I was. Okay. Resetting the game. Great! I'm gonna cut back to when I do this the right way. And not as an idiot. You're seeing the title screen right now. You don't need to be. Alright, take two, and we're already getting off to an awful start because he stole Luigi's hammer immediately. Alright, so, I'm an idiot. You're supposed to defeat Popple first to get the rewards from both of them. I, I'm gonna check this. Birdo is 900 experience, 99 coins. Popple is an extra 500 experience and another 99 coins. Okay. Got this. Actually got this. Actually got this. Okay. Interesting thing is, I realized this, I look. I just wanted to look up the boss data while I was in the process of walking in between areas, I guess. Um... Popple loses HP in between fights with him. The third fight outside the Winkle Coliseum, he had 520 HP. This fight, he has 500 proper. So, yeah, uh, you're not good at your job. Again, Popple. Actually, no, I only have Thunder Bros left, so I'll just jump. Uh, I'm doing a lot. Oh, great, this will restore Birdo's HP. And hurt me. Well, it's not gonna really matter, because Luigi couldn't have counterattacked that anyway, and I did. I would like to actually. I'm gonna try to do Swing Bros again. Probably not going to succeed to do Swing Bros again. I'm... Alright, so the flopping Luigi does 17, I think that said. Alright. So yes, Birdo does actually get more... Okay, didn't need the... Wait! He took my hammer... I had my hammer back and he took it before I realized he had it. This is this is already significantly worse than the previous, the pre just the previous. I must have been screwing up the action commands before, because Luigi. Yeah, I did 10 damage with Luigi's jump on defense lower Popple before. And now I did 37. All right, there's got to be a way of telling which one has Popple in it. At least before they attack. All right, I can't dodge any of those. Alright, so the ones that jump, the bomb will aim for the opposite bro. The ones that jump, uh, rather, the ones that jump twice will aim for the opposite. The ones that jump once will aim for whichever one 
um, they start running forward, but you can actually just hit the button at the same time. Not gonna waste any BP doing this. You see, it's Popple's always in the last one. No matter what, he's all. I could use the hammer game. This one better go for Mario, because good. I could really use Levon. I mean, I guess Popple has the hammer, and he's in the egg right now. So, all right, I have the hammer. Don't want to get hit by that again. I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna wait until he has lowered defenses again before I go for the swing bros. Because if you do it right, you can do a lot of damage. Like before, we did 150 to Birdo, which is fantastic. The hard part is because Birdo has less HP. Not accidentally killing her with a counter attack. Swing bros, poople. Target, target. I guess he doesn't have anything to steal? Question mark? Exclamation point? I'm gonna just do Swing Bros again, actually, because... Do I want to do Swing Bros again, actually? Alright, I better get... Does Luigi have his hammer? I don't know. I'm gonna keep doing Swing Bros until I get the advance correct, I guess. I must just not be pressing the right button. Well, he's dead anyway. You may have defeated my darling, but that's as far as you go! That's a reference, and now she's red. That scares me. I have no idea how he defeated Popple so quickly, actually. So, 320. That's a lot easier to... I mean, she's a lot more powerful, as you could see. But 320 is a lot less HP to worry about than 500. Or is it even 320? It might be 3... No, it's definitely not 300, I was gonna say. Uh, I have the computer to the right of me, and I could check, but... That does damn. I guess I've never screwed that up before. Oh. Okay, she has 450. Never mind, this is still going to be hard. Ah... Uh... Alright, so that's 9 times, that's 36 damage each time. It's not that great. I haven't had to heal, actually. So that is a good thing. As you notice, she also messes around with the timing of these. You know, if I didn't have to keep spamming bros attacks that I need to get the advanced commands for, this would be so much easier, because I could actually use the ones that cause damage, like, I don't know, advanced chopper, or do swing bros again and get another ultra serum. But, nope. Nope. Stuck doing the bad ones. That one's not even gonna get the three hits, is it? Because I don't think I didn't mash. No, I guess it did. Okay, she's not doing any other attacks. This is actually getting a little boring. She sure is boring around here. All right, no defense decrease. So I'm just gonna let loose with swing, because I I already know that you can actually steal from her, or you can completely screw up the action command. Should have had longer to do that, but I guess not. Are you kidding me? Am I really screwing this up so badly? I mean, regardless, if she has normal defenses, swing is still going to do a huge amount of damage. If I don't keep missing, do absolutely nothing, and now I need to restore Luigi's BP so I can actually do stuff again. Ah. Uh... Alright, she's gotta be getting low on HP at least. She keeps doing. Uh, game! Alright, the way I see it is. Basically, every turn now, she's. Game! Basically, every turn now, she's trying to heal. I'm seeing this as a desperation thing. Where I still can't do that action command correctly. I'm, I'm seeing this as a desperation thing, which means hopefully, hopefully, this could be almost done. I only have enough left for Splash Bros. 
I don't remember which one's advance. I guess it was not the one I did. Uh, let's do... I just did Thunder. Where's... Wait. Oh, wait. I screwed up Thunder again. I did a lot better in terms of getting the action commands last time, that's for sure. And I wasted all my... Wait! We got Advanced Thunder Bros. That's all... That is entirely worth it. That is entirely worth it. Now I only have two attacks left to work on. Um, I'm gonna... Didn't lower the defense, but I'm gonna try Advanced out this time, see what happens. Boom. A. A. Boom. That just... I guess that does an uppercut that does more damage to individual enemy? I jumped the wrong time. Do you have... She has not gotten her defenses lowered, I guess. She might be immune to it in the ragey form, but I can just... I don't feel like wasting BP restoring items. So, I'm... I keep getting faked out by doing the same thing every time. Uh, I'm gonna just, like... Do that. That works. Yes, I definitely got more stuff. I got five Ultra Syrups. Popple's supposed to drop a Golden Mushroom, actually. I gotta level up. I'm gonna... I'm gonna pow. I'm gonna do pow with Luigi. He doesn't really need it, but I'm gonna do it. Should probably have done BP or something. Mario didn't get a level up. Ah, or, you, look at you. Pathetic. You're useless, see? Eh? You, you're fired! That was not the Popple voice very well. Uh, I can't see what that says. Um, the Super Mario Wiki page for Popple I had to open apparently was playing sound for some reason. Are, are you saying that it was all my fault? <laughs> the crying face. It was, like, it was like a SpongeBob crying face. That was, that was terrible. This is going to be a short episode because I screwed up the entire boss fight. Um, I don't know why I skipped that dialogue. I, I can't... Like, I just can't do Birdo voice, I guess. I'm going to I'm gonna say that. I can't do Birdo voice, so I'm just going to skip any time she ever has dialogue in a game I LP. I was going to say something. Then I wasn't. Where even are we? Alright, we're... here. So, let's go to the Bean Bean outskirts. Let's... Um... What... Do we... I think we go to the castle town? Yes, this is the part where we go to the castle town after I get another chuckle bean. Oh, no. that, what did I even touch? Like, literally, what did I even touch to get into that fight? How is this thing alive? There we go. Wow, some can't wait to die. That was a reference to a game that I have not played that I have been watching someone else who is famouser than me and whose compatriots I have referenced several times to play. Anyway, this happened again. Uh, I probably should have mentioned, you should have done those... Not hitting ZR. You should have done all those side quests. The two side quests, all two of them. The skies are raining destruction. It's the end of everything. This town will be destroyed. We all gotta take refuge. You should too. Excellent with my voice acting. So yeah, I was trying to go for the... There's one really stupid voice clip in Fire Emblem Awakening for a generic old guy, and it's like, THUNDERATIONS! Like, literally, exactly like that. I've always... I've been trying to get that. Alright, so... No, I meant... I meant to say, shut up and don't talk to me anymore. That's the right answer. Okay, I need to check... I remember... Alright, Woohoo Blend, Chuckle Blend, and Hulumbian. Those were the ones that I have made. Those were the ones that I have made. So I'm going to see... I can make... Hoohoo Blend? Well, I can't make the Tiki Blend, that's for sure. Alright, let's see. Can I make... A Chuckachino? I can make the Chuckachino! I can make the Chuckachino. This better be right, because almost positive Hulumbian was the one that I made before. See, the thing, problem I need, I just need he beans. Okay, yes, this one was good. The, ga the, the freaking Game Boy Horror SP just drops out of nowhere. EGAD's on it. You see, if you're playing this on a GBA, there is a Game Boy, co a Game Boy Color literally inside your Game Boy Advance, and there's a ghost! 
Harmless friendly little ghost, this game confirmed to be in between Luigi's Mansion and Dark Moon. Ghosts drink coffee. I think we might have sent him to the other side. Yeah, literally just heavenly. And then the ghost gives us the, the one piece of the Triforce. That was obviously the Great Force was supposed to be the Triforce. Which was supposed to be what Link gives you. Gave you. Gave you. Alright. I need he beans. I just need 28 he beans. Somehow. 28 he beans. And I can get the rest of these stupid coffees. And he's doing the, the video conference again. I promise I'm too busy with my research. No need for that. New warping capability. So, we do actually get to drink the coffee. I mean, he flat out steals it. He doesn't try... I mean, the ghost stole the coffee, too. The other ones were he actually... Drunk... Get, what was this supposed to be? Uh, power grip was supposed to be something. I don't remember who or what that was actually supposed to be. But... I've now made five blends. I should now have made five blends. Which means I'm going to quickly look up how you get he beans. Because I think those are from mini games, and I don't appreciate it. He bean. He bean. Stardust Fields, Hoo Hoo Mountain, Little Fungatown. Little Fungatown. Um, um, yeah, I, uh, uh, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna go Bean Bean Castle, see a cutscene, go to Little Fungatown, grind he beans in Star Stash Smash, and actually, uh, there's a way you can play Barrel there now that the SS Chicole is gone. Um,. Oh, Mario Bros, this is the most desperate hour. The end of the Bean Bean Kingdom may be at hand. Bowser's castle has unleashed his assault on the Bean Bean Kingdom from the skies overhead. Well, that's a new one. That's... Well, I guess it might be the Paper Mario one heavily remodeled. This is Bowletta's doing. We're utterly defenseless against an attack from the sky. We have safely evacuated Princess Peach and the others to Little Fungatown. Hmm, at least Princess Peach is safe, that's something. But if we don't do something about Bowser's castle, our poor kingdom may not survive. Uh, what's that now? You know something about Bowser's castle. You say you know how to get from Bowser's room to the bathroom. What an odd thing to say. Oh, I get it. You're saying that you Mario Bros know Bowser's castle like the backs of your hands. I, for one, feel very reassured knowing the Mario Bros are going up to that horrible castle. Poing! No, this is our kingdom's problem. We cannot impose upon them any more than we have. Well, that certainly may be true. Farewell! Wow. Great. Great job listening to your mother, Prince Beasley. Great. I actually don't remember if you have to go up and talk to them again. Or... Are they even here? Brave indeed. Someone who can fly. Someone whose legs you can cling to. Probably see where this is going. It's... It's... Uh, well, actually, I don't want to spoil it, because this is something that happened like a year ago, because I'm terrible at uploading. Anyway. I'm going to actually check the armor and badge store here. See if, like, it actually got new stuff. The, the, the brand jeans, which... Destroy everything of Luigi's stats. The Heart Slacks, which destroy everything of Mario's stats. And the Casual Slacks, which do very little as well. Let's see what bad... Um, Sarge Badge, which does god-awful for everyone's stats. General Badge, which is better version of this. And the tank badge, which I guess lets you restore HP with your jump. Right, I'm going to get the general badge for both of them. I'm actually going to do that. I know that the bros rock is actually important and a side quest item. 
But you don't need it anymore. Like, I don't need the soulful, soulful bros. I need the brilliant badge. I don't need the piranha swing. I don't even know why I kept that. I'm going to keep these coffees just so I remember which one. Okay, plus four speed. Chuckle button is good because of that. Now, I'm going to actually go to Little Fungatown. Make sure I didn't completely make a mistake and buy... Well, actually, there's one other minigame we could do, but it's... Yeah, that'll be in the next episode. Actually, yeah, we're near... I just realized I'm nearer to the end of this game than Skyward Sword. LP5 is finishing before LP4. I think this is a testament to something about me being bad at math, but I'm too bad at math to figure out what I'm supposed to say about how that's not the right way. Where are the... where's the warp pipe for this area? There, Unless I didn't get it at all. Probably didn't get it at all. Number three is somewhere in this area of getting into a battle that I'm going to win in exactly one turn. That's great. Um, uh, thought Mario was actually going to get a level up there. That would have been gnarly. Yo. Yeah. I don't know. So, where is the pipe? I have actually no idea where this is supposed to be. I could probably walk to Little Fungatown faster. I just really don't want to. I'm gonna take the pipe... I can go all the way to Stardust Fields and take that pipe and it will be faster than finding the, the one that I actually should be getting. I'm actually commentating over all of this. Because why not? Actually, if you're Ultra Hammers, totally forgot about this can go here where we already went. Wait. I know there's actually a point to this. Or no, is this a... This is the entrance to Gafwaha Ruins, isn't it? Yeah. Bruh. I legitimately never knew about this. So Gafwaha Ruins is actually part of Huhu Mountain and not- Wait, there's a mole. Why is there a mole? What? Okay, guess you need just need Ultra Hammers to come back here and get the mole. What does the mole give us? Uh, Max Nut. I'm not even gonna make a comment on that. That's a really good item. That is- There will be one occasion when I will be busting out every healing item in my inventory and having the Max Nut. Not just a max nut, an M-A-X, all capital nut, will be incredibly helpful. So as you saw, we cannot actually go back into Gafuaho Ruins, but I figured out a way to get to Little Fungatown without having to use any yellow pipes, because I am so incredibly inept at actually looking for things or remembering where fast travel is in an RPG with a decently... I'm not going to say this is a decently large world. It's small by mod. I don't know. Was it was it big for its time? I don't think so. It's fairly certain it's not the biggest thing on the GBA in terms of just world size. Anyway, I'm going to stop the episode now. Uh, when next you see me, I will hopefully have a lot more he beans. Like, a lot. Actually, I'm going to... Is this just the item shop, or do you... That's one creepy toad. I'm not trying to sell. I'm trying to go away, because that's not what I wanted. Uh, I have no idea. I This is probably longer than it should be, this episode, because I realized I'm still keeping in the entire first Popple fight. Uh, you better actually have something for me. I came all this way in... The Scandal Jeans and the Mushluck Pants. Uh, mush Badge AA and... That was a complete waste of time! I will see you in the next episode! 
when I understand that things usually don't turn out. I don't even just this is the end of the episode. Stop watching the video now, please.